Oh, I'm gonna cry. What's up my beautiful babes? I am so excited for today's video because it's America's Next Top Model and if you know me, you know I love America's Next Top Model and also the new season is so good you can tell they got a way bigger budget this year. Tyra is back honey, though they still have not hired me for the show which I am waiting for, okay? Hi America's Next Top Model, hire me. I'm here and I'm ready to be a judge on America's Next Top Model. Hi. <laughs> so usually when I make these America's Next Top Model makeover reaction videos, I usually have not even watched any of the seasons, so I just see the makeovers because I haven't watched America's Next Top Model in like five years, honestly. It just got like a little bit slow for me and it wasn't as exciting as it was before, but this new season, girl, I'm so into. I am watching it. So I've watched the first two episodes and Last night they aired the makeover episode and I have been waiting to watch it so I can watch it with you guys. So I am dying to watch this right now. All right, I'm not gonna bore you guys. Let's just get this video started, shall we? Let's get it started. Time the mail. Time the mail! <laughs> Hi. It's time to capture the new you for the world oh, to see. You are getting a trademark style, which will transform your look into an edgy editorial version of yourself that will help you stand out in this cutthroat modeling industry. I have been studying you, and I am ready with your title. Study and go. These aren't normal makeovers. These aren't, let's just go to salon and just get our hair done. These They're are titles. These are overs. official. This is what's going to take us to the next level. Sandra. Blunt, long bob. Yes! I feel like I have been conditioned to associate beauty like with long hair. Growing up, I just heard people always think that short hair is ugly. So I'm just trusting the process. Christina, you had such That'll a cool exchange her. with Law during casting week. I don't really like her. As I've gotten older, <laughs> I'm, I'm like not going to like everybody either. You need hair to match that. Highlighter hair. Nice! Christina, oh. platinum. Liz, oh. bubblegum, pink. Liberty, oh, you I can't even keep red, up. So you're going red. Oh no. She voted red, so she's going red. Oh, because I'm pro Trump. That's why. Ah, the tea, tea has been long, spilled. Wavy hair. <gasps> Bring on the yak. Bring on the yak. Ryan, weave right down to the floor. Oh. Shanice, you're going bigger, like my girl Serena Williams. Kyla, you're going brown. And a couple of tracks won't hurt. Cora. You're getting the Cora. It's called the Cora. And it's mysterious. Tyra, what are you about to do to me? I don't know if I should be excited or nervous. Rio. Bye bye to your hair. But hello, Platinum. Gina, that wig that you have, you're going to have to say goodbye to her. I do have alopecia universalis, which Aww. is an autoimmune disease that causes your body to attack that your hair follicles. Needs I lost to my hair when I was 10 and I had to do wigs. I was so attached to it. Now I have to take it off. I've not dealt with She's people really seeing me pretty. like that. Uh. Listen. Her wig could be so much more snatched than it is. Okay, she needs a new one. She needs a new one. Take anything but red. Like, red is just not me. Yeah, out. no, it's not. Like I'm gonna her. look like a fire crotch. No, like, no. <laughs> but that's kind of rude to say because there are people that have red hair. And I'm no, but I don't. Oh. That's not good. You shouldn't be talking like that about people with red hair. It's super <laughs> offensive. There is gonna be some She did not just go there. Wait, you know what? gonna be some tea. This tears every day in this house. <laughs> oh my god, she's so offensive. <laughs> Fan, what is that style? Style? Um, Hi, models. Hi. Hi. Welcome <laughs> to the very prestigious Andy Lacombe salon. This here should be in me, West by the way. Andy Lacombe I should be replacing like Drew next season. Kylie Jenner, and also we transformed Miley Cyrus. Okay. Now Tyra already revealed your looks to you. And Cora, I know you're anxious to know what the Cora is. Yeah. Well, it's you. Oh, yeah. The look that you already have, we think is fantastic. They love her so much. Thank you. 
she's obsessed you know, with her. Like, she's it. She already has her look. Meaning, Tyra's already in love with her. <laughs> yeah. Now, to get you started with your amazing looks, I want you to meet the co-owner of the Andy Lacombe Salon, Leanne Citroni. Hi, guys. Welcome. Hi. Hi. We have a lot of work to do, so let's get started. Here we go. Right. I'm so excited. I'm nervous about having my head shaved and buzzed. Mm. She's gonna look so All right, good. Oh my! I know it will bring me to that next. That's level a look. Actual high fashion modeling. It's a look. I feel like this is just gonna bring out the inner. Oh, uh, here go the weaves. These my weave is weaves. to the floor. You have no idea how happy I am. No. Anything I hear in the house from now on is not working. It's not even like well done. Beautiful. Looks Perfect. like the same. Uh -oh. Knowing that the wig is gonna come We got the off, tears coming. Brings me back to stuff that happened at school. Bring in, bro. How mean people were pulling my hair off on the bus, saying that I have cancer, or that something's wrong with me. You just start to remember everything mm. that people said. Hi, you. Can we can we take your wig off now? Because I don't even know what's under. Um, I just never know. It's a surprise every time. Like I always hope that there's hair there, but sometimes there's not. Aww. I think it will be so freeing to you. Oh, you're so beautiful. <laughs> you so bad. You take your tragedy and you turn it into your platform. You are so brave. This world is going to look at you and say, if she can do it, I can do it. You ready? We're going to start the process. I'll hold your hand if you want me to. Many of people have told me I'm not beautiful. Doing this is really scary, but I want to show people that it's okay to be bald and that bald is beautiful. Oh, I love her. Losing your hair is beautiful. Just a make, of, she's gonna be bald. Really rough things, which resulted in me losing yeah, my hair, really losing my hair, which is so little strength. Like, this I is the first. No. Beautiful. Look at me from there. Nice. Okay. I dig it. Oh my god. I feel yes, more she's confident, and I feel gorgeous. like this makes me more high fashion. I honestly love it. Okay, Kim Kardashian, watch out. <laughs> oh no. No. <laughs> no. No. What's up, Lady Liberty? How you doing? Oh, God. We were both the red. I'm this morning because I've never changed my look, so I'm so, like, yeah. it's just, like, a shock, I guess. I um, think it's going to give you that whole rock star. Just, you know, take oh, a little bit of Idaho, some more of LA. Will this help me be a Democrat? <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> oh. So pretty. Oh, I was really hesitant when I, I heard that I'm going it. to be going red, but I'm really happy because I need it's to not, bring in a little bit more power and edge in order it's to not step red. my game in this competition, and I think that this hair definitely did that for me. It's copper, okay? It's like an orange, and it's really pretty. I thought they were going to do like bright red. Hey! Nice. Okay, okay, okay. I feel like I look 20 years younger. I love the trademark look that Tyra gave me. It's cute. It's cute. It looks so good. I am so in love. Oh my this god, this is it what looks is going to so for years to come. Good. 
she looks like so much more of a model I'm now. I'm getting a trim, and it's kind of difficult for me because I love my hair. Growing up, people would compliment me for having long hair. So I'm just like trying to like compose myself right now. You, you cannot cry. So I'm not sad. I like her hair like, too. I would sit me a lot. To wear my natural hair and stuff like that. And I feel like what we're doing with your hair today is gonna show more of that. Yeah, because it has so much color. Yeah, it? when you take it down, it's gonna. Let's see. Look at your face. It's okay, it's You've been hiding all of that. What are they doing there? I'm going to figure out how to work this. I have to learn how to be oh. confident in a real way oh. if I'm gonna have this hair. I liked it longer. I have to learn how to be beautiful in a non Okay, way. Oh. I don't know, she's like. Turned me into a My Little Ponies. Like, yes. that's like Christmas for like every little girl. Seriously. I'm oh, so excited to try out my looks now. Yes. And just like be more. I more love pink hair so much. A little more if you know what I mean. It looks so good. Nice. Great. Keep going. Keep moving. Mm. Have you done a sewing before? They could have colored it or something. <laughs> like what? They didn't do anything. Growing I just up, want to show this last part. Gina, you inspired the two cute. judges that were at the transformation. And she inspired me too. They are ready to bear themselves to the world <gasps> right now. What do they do? Image architect, stylist to the stars, La Roche. Oh. So. <laughs> Almost 100 pounds heavier than Looks I am really now. really good though with the bald head. Why am I so emotional today? To fight against the weight. And I just got tired of it. So I, I shared the weight. But I was still holding on to things that to disguise some of the insecurities that I had. And we have really the creative cool director head. of Paper Magazine, Drew Elliott. So I have vitiligo. And so I have spots on my eyes, on my mouth, on my hands, and I always cover it up. Aww. But today, I show it. It's for all of those people that have insecurities. I've worn mine on my face every day. I have always preached about accepting who you are. It is all beautiful. This is such a good now message. Okay, so that was such a great episode of America's Next Top Model. The makeovers this season, like, nobody cried over, like, their stupid makeovers. Besides the girl with alopecia, but, like, that's completely understandable. I'm sure she was very uncomfortable. And guess what? She got through it, and now she is rocking a bald head, and she looks so fierce. I'm just so happy for the girl who removed her wig. She is helping so many people in the world and it's seriously inspiring. And I've had a lot of skin issues in my past and I will be making a video about that um, in the near future. And it is gonna be very hard for me to make because I've never really told anybody about 
you know, what fully happened to me. Uh, and it's really hard for me to talk about and I'm not really an emotional person, but I will be making that in the future. But I really do want to share my story with you guys because I think it's so important to grow from the things you've been through and get past them and help others as much as you possibly can. Besides all of that, I loved the makeover of the girl who went from blonde to a coppery red. I thought I was gonna hate it and she looked amazing. But they said they were making her red. They, were, they made her copper. Those are two different things. I mean, it's in like the red family, but she went copper, like orange, not red, red. I thought it was gonna be like Rihanna red and it was not gonna be cute, but like she looked fierce and girl, she worked it in front of the camera. Like, oh my gosh, she might win this competition. Just gonna say it. Let me know what your favorite look was down below. Don't forget to give this video a like. It really helps me and I'd really appreciate it. And if you're not already subscribed to me, like, the button's right there and it's like super easy to press, I promise. You just like go and you go and it's like, that's it. Like you're subscribed, you're good to go. And then like, if you really want to, like hit the bell button and then you'll get like notifications for like when I post videos and like that'd be super cool too. <laughs> but if you don't want to, I completely understand. <laughs> and today's Instagram shout out goes to Nick. This is his Instagram name and this is what he looks like. He says, hey Brad, I love your videos and I think you're really funny. Oh, thank you. Uh, right now my hair is a medium dark brown and I really want to switch it up. Should I go bright yellow? It's my favorite color. Wow, bright yellow, huh? That would be, I mean, girl, live your extra life, right? <laughs> if you want to go bright yellow, I think you should totally do it. That is such a statement. I think it's dope but I would really love to see your hair blue. Oh, I think it would look so good with your eye color and your haircut. I think it would look so amazing. Go for that yellow if you feel strongly about it. If you have the confidence to pull off yellow, then I say go for it. And if you have not checked out my Live Your Extra Life merchandise yet, why? It's literally the most fabulous, most glamorous, most extra merch to ever have been made. So you need to check it out right now. What was that? Oh, where can you buy it? Oh, well just go to liveyourextralife.com and you can purchase whatever you want. <laughs> and thank you guys so much for watching today. Don't forget to live your extra life and I will see you all next time. Peace.